Habitat's mission is to really put God's love into action by bringing people together to build homes and communities and hope. And the Catholic Church is very much the same. I mean, we're taught that every person is really in the likeness of God. Every person should have the ability to really grow and become all that God has intended for them. All the Catholic parishes in Pierce County have come together to sponsor this house back here. We're doing it in honor of, of Pope Francis and his Jubilee. So Pope Francis's call for the Year of Mercy is really challenging parish bishops, priests, and all of the parishioners to get out of their church and really perform acts of mercy and forgiveness and to be generous. The Pope has been calling us, and all of the world, not just Catholics, to, to live out that message of mercy. Um, so making sure that we're taking care of those who are less fortunate, the poor and the hungry. I love St. Francis. Well, he should be St. Francis, Pope Francis. He is a grassroots, um, where the rubber meets the road kind of a Pope. This is a, a physical reflection of what Pope Francis is asking us to do. Catholic, Christians, Christians in general, but people as a whole, we need to experience mercy and to extend that mercy out to people also in helping them out. It's important for us as Catholics in the surrounding community and different parishes to come together and work together because it helps us to realize that we're not just people in one parish and another parish and another parish over there, but that we're all connected. And so the idea that you find people that you can work with and then the next thing you know, you see them in church and they're not in their painting gear, they're, you know, dressed up. It's something that you remember and you get little nicknames and it's fun. Everyone's here for the same cause and everyone's really excited about it. I will never get tired of seeing a house be built in just a matter of months. It's so fun. These people are coming out every day and working so hard. And it's really a labor of love and then you get to see the final product and it's incredible. It took a little over four months to build this house. It involved hundreds of parishioners throughout Pierce County from 29 parishes. And they came out in the rain, they came out in the heat, uh, they came out in droves and had a great time building this house. I don't know, it feels, it feels really good because um, it feels like really living my faith. Uh, there's a reason why when you do something good, it feels good because it's natural. It's what you're supposed to be doing, you know? Nothing's free in this world and, and if you are lucky enough that you have enough to have a roof over your head, to have food on the table, then I think it's a responsibility to give back. I really feel like that's that's the essence of the Catholic faith is works back back up the faith. As long as you're just sitting back and you're not really taking part in, in helping the community, you're not really live, fully living the faith. Just to get out and use our hands, physically use our hands, is just good. It's just, it's almost like a, a soul food, if you will. This is how is the homeless. And so this is just one of those works of mercy and, and this is, here it is. It feels really great because this whole development is all habitat houses and to help somebody to really get the dream come true of, having, of owning their home, own home, it's really great to be part of it. Yeah, it's one of those works of mercy and to help those who are less fortunate, in particular those who can't afford a, a home on their own otherwise. It's nice to be able to come out and volunteer and you actually, at the end of the day, see the difference that you made. It's, it's something that you can visually, you see the proof of the difference that you're making. It, it gets in your blood. You volunteer once and more than likely, you'll be back. I think the work of Habitat works well with the, the deanery and the Catholic Church because we're both looking to help those who are in need. <laughs> this has been an incredible collaboration for Habitat and the Catholic deanery. And I don't look at this as being all wrapped up in the end. I think this could be just the beginning.